Hi! In this video, we are going to discuss about equation of a circle. How to find the center, the radius, and the equation. The equation of a circle came from the, the Pythagorean theorem. A squared plus B squared is equal to C squared. Take note that the standard equation of a circle is x minus h squared plus y minus k squared is equal to r squared, where the center is hk and the radius is r. Now take note that your hk or the center of the circle can be at the origin which is 0, 0 and the center of the circle can be in the other parts of the quadrant or the uh, Cartesian plane. Okay, so we'll be discussing about three cases for this particular topic. So let's go to case number one. How to find the equation of a circle given the center and the radius. Example number one. What is the equation of a circle with center at 2, 7 and a radius of 6 units? Now remember that your center is at 2, 7. So ibig sabihin ito ay um, wala sa center ng Cartesian plane. And the radius of uh, the circle is 6 units. So using this information, we will substitute the values dun sa ating equation ng circle. Now, since ang center natin is at 2, 7, your h will be your 2 and your 7 will be your k. Isa substitute natin siya or ilalagay natin siya dun sa equation. So, since yung 2 natin ay positive, so ang gagawin nyo na lang is palitan nyo yung h ng 2. And then yung k, papalitan nyo ng 7. And then your radius, which is 6, ipapalit nyo sa r. So you'll have x minus 2 squared plus y minus 7 squared is equal to 6 squared. So yung radius dito, yung 6 squared, yun na lang yung isosolve nyo. So you'll have x minus 2 squared plus y minus 7 squared is equal to 36. So this is the equation of the circle. Example number 2. What is the equation of a circle with center at negative 5, 3 and a radius of 12 units? Now, remember your hk, h is negative 5 and your k is positive 3. At yung r natin is equal to 12 units. Now, remember dito sa ating equation, yung h nyo ay negative 5. So, yan ay magiging x minus minus 5 squared plus y minus 3 squared is equal to 12 squared. So, yung x minus minus 5, so negative times negative, magiging positive yan. So, x plus 5 squared plus y minus 3 squared is equal to 144. So, gusto ko lang kunin yung inyong attention dito sa pagkuha ng um, equation natin. So, pag tinignan nyo dito, negative h yan at negative 5 dito, magpapalit lang siya magiging positive. So, para mas madali lang, you get this value, itong h nyo, negative 5 yan, palitan nyo ng sign, magiging positive. Yung k nyo, palitan nyo ng sign, positive siya dito, dito naman siya magiging negative 3. And then, kunin nyo lang yung r, 12, and then you square that, 144. Okay? Next, example number 3. What is the equation of a circle with center at the origin and a radius of 4 units? Now, remember, yung center at the origin, ibig sabihin yan, yung center nyo ay nasa 0, 0. So, yung h nyo, 0. Yung k nyo rin ay 0. And then, your radius, your r is equal to 4 units. So, magiging x minus 0 squared plus y minus 0 squared is equal to 4 squared. So, since 0 naman yan, pwede nyo na lang tanggalin. So, what's going to be left is x squared plus y squared is equal to 
4 times 4, 16. So, ito na yung equation ng ating circle. Case number 2. How to find the center and the radius if the equation of a circle is given. Example number 1. What is the center and the radius of x minus 2 squared plus y minus 7 squared is equal to 36? So, paano kukunin yung center? So, mas mabilis lang is you get your HK, so dito yung negative 2 at yung negative 7, papalitan nyo lang yan ng sign. So kung negative 2 dito, your H is positive 2. At kung negative 7 naman dito, yun ay magiging positive 7. That's going to be your K. Tapos naman, yung inyong radius, yung 36, kukunan nyo lang siya ng square root. Okay, so from there, you will get your radius. So center nyo. Change the sign ulit. Negative 2, magiging positive 2. Negative 7, magiging positive 7. And then your radius, get the square root of 36. That's 6. What is the center and radius of x squared plus y squared is equal to 16? Now, in this case, wala kayong makikitang h at saka k sa tabi ni x squared at saka ni y squared. So, ibig sabihin, yung center mo ay nasa origin. Okay? So, ang center nasa origin, ang coordinates nun ay 0, 0. This is comma. And then, kunin natin yung radius. So, saan galing yung radius? Sa square root of 16. Yung square root of 16 is equal to 4. So, ibig sabihin yan, yung center nyo, 0, 0, radius is 4. Case number 3. How to find the equation of a circle given the graph? Example number 1. Write an equation of a circle given the graph below. So, pag tinignan natin yung ating graph dito, ang center niya ay nasa 0, 0. At ang radius niya, paano mo malalaman if it's 4? So, tingnan niyo yung movement. So, from the center, so 1, 2, 3, 4. Or pwede rin pag ganito. 1, 2, 3, 4. Kung ayaw niyo niyan, 1, 2, 3, 4. So, the radius is equal to 4. So, using this, the formula, x minus 0 squared plus y minus 0 squared is equal to 4 squared. Solve natin. So, magiging x squared plus y squared is equal to 4 squared or equal to 16. Example number 2 tayo. Write an equation of a circle given the graph below. So, hanapin muna natin yung center. So, yung center natin, hanapin muna natin yung x. Yung x niya nandito. Dito siya. So, ito ay nasa negative 1. Tapos, yung y niya ay nasa negative 2. So, dito siya. So, ang center natin is at negative 1, 2. And then, yung radius, paano nakuha yung 5? So, from the center, bilang tayo. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, kung gusto nyo, pababa. So, from the center, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Kaya ang radius niya ay 5. Okay? So, substitute natin doon sa formula. Okay? So, magiging x. Change the sign ng negative 1, magiging positive 1. Negative 2, magiging positive 2. So, x plus 1 squared plus y plus 2 squared is equal to 5 squared. So, sa ano na lang natin to simplify na lang natin yung 5 squared. So, that will give us x plus 1 squared plus y plus 2 squared is equal to 25. So, yun yung equation ng ating circle. Okay, I hope you learned something today. Kung nahihirapan, pwedeng panoorin ulit yung video. At don't forget to practice of my time. Now, if you find this video helpful, pakipress ang like, pakipress ang share, and then mag-subscribe na rin for new updates. Thank you. Have a good day.